Hey folks, Country Prepper here. What I got for you today is the Three Night Archer 1AV3. So let's just dig into the box and see what we got. Alright, so the first thing I noticed on the box is it says 1AV2, but this is the version 3. So uh, just in case anybody else noticed that, I thought I'd say something. Uh, it does come with a little uh, lanyard here. And a couple other things. It has uh, extra O-rings and an extra tail caps button there so nice that they add those extra things there's your uh, lanyard and a little slider on there that's pretty cool and then of course the flashlight there it is what else do we have in here got the foam thingy the little silicon packet Some different instructions, run times, things like that. We'll take a look at that a little closer here in a second. And then all of this uh, that I can't read. And kind of a little note. Alright, so there's a little uh, better look at the flashlight. Let's have a pocket clip on there. does have the uh, tail cap switch and then the mode button up here. Now this flashlight will work with either a AA or a lithium-ion uh, 14500 rechargeable and with that rechargeable battery, uh, just by comparison, uh, you're getting about two to two and a half times the uh, lumen output uh, on this little flashlight. So uh, that is really cool for a flashlight this size. One thing just right off the bat with first impressions is I wish that pocket clip was a lot deeper. I wish it came clear up to the back of here and uh, you know just a much deeper pocket clip I prefer for a flashlight. I don't really like having a whole lot of a flashlight sticking out because um, it just it, it tends to when you're sitting down fall out of your pocket easier so uh, a little deeper pocket clip would have been kind of nice so first I'm going to show you the uh, different modes with just a double A battery and then I'll show you what it looks like with the 14500 uh, I'm on Firefly right now but you can't see it uh, that's 0.1 lumens runs for 17 days uh, low 17 lumens that'll run for 22 hours Medium is 75 lumens, and that'll run for uh, five hours. And on high is 200 lumens, runs for 115 minutes. Uh, you can also press and hold, and that gives you the strobe, which is also 200 lumens for three and a half hours. All right, there is the low mode. I don't know what the run times or the exact lumens are going to be, but they're going to be, like I said, about two to two and a half times uh, what you get out of double A. So, there's medium, and there's high, and watch out, here comes strobe. So that is pretty bright for a single battery flashlight. Alright, just to give you a couple more specs on this, it has a beam distance of 66 meters, it is IPX8 water resistant, and has a drop rating uh, or impact rating of up to one meter. So my final thoughts on this, I did put the uh, lanyard on there just so you could see it. Uh, usually I'd be shooting this video outside, but it's raining again. So uh, anyhow, uh, final thoughts is I think this would be a great EDC flashlight if you don't mind the uh, pocket clip, if you don't mind that, uh, that part sticking out of your pocket a little bit. But uh, I think this is going to get thrown in one of my survival kits and I think it'd be great for that because, uh, you, like I said, you can just throw a AA battery back in it or uh, I have an extra 14500 I could put in it too. So uh, I think that would be a, a great flashlight. A couple other th Another thing that I really like is the, the mode switch is really simple. Uh, you just you turn it on and click through your modes. Really simple and hold it down to get strobe so and it goes right back to whatever mode you had it in before so good memory on it and on and off goes back to the same uh, uh, mode that you had it in uh, it does have a little bit of a strike bezel on it but nothing major and this flashlight goes for about 36 bucks at the time of this video it's 36 bucks on Amazon so I'll leave a link in the de the description box for you to go check it out if you're interested in something like this and uh, 
So I want to thank Through Night for sending this to me. I'm hoping to do a couple other ones that I'm interested in. And uh, there's kind of a stigma around Through Night because they send out so many flashlights. But you've seen all the torture testing. Uh, Jack over at Black Scout Survival. Uh, Chris over at Prepared Mind 101. Uh, a lot of guys, they just beat the crap out of these flashlights and ju they just keep going. So I don't see anything wrong with this flashlight. So uh, order the company that makes it. They stand behind their product. They have a great warranty. So that's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Check out all the links in the description box below. And uh, see you next time.